it is very useful to think of carbon atoms as belonging to a chain and pendant system. This analogy is very valuable for beginners since it gives a conceptual understanding of the subject. Rather than think about carbon compounds as long carbon chains or close or cyclic, it's very useful to think of them like a chain or a carbon skeleton. This chain we refer to is being referred to a carbon skeleton like the one shown here. A carbon skeleton without any attached structures or any other any other attached atoms. Dependent refers to the functional group. The functional group is what gives the organic compound its unique and typical property. Functional groups are many. The ones, a few of the important ones are listed here, such as the OH, the hydroxy, the chloro groups, carboxylic acid groups, and an aldehyde group. This is very similar to a pendant. You can think of it as a precious stone, such as a diamond or a ruby or an emerald, which has been attached to the same gold chain. If you think of a carbon atom conceptually or a carbon skeleton as this form, an attachment of a hydroxy group at any point in the chain will confer properties unique to a hydroxy group. The same carbon, carbon chain, you add that some other group, say a carboxylic group, it will confer organic acid properties to that group. Hence, this would be a very valuable way to understand the nomenclature as well as an organic compound itself.